Wine um, is a great thing for bringing your friends and your family together because what it does is it allows everybody to spread out their meal. It makes it so you take more time, which means you actually talk and um, share and laugh and have a great time. And it makes the w me food better and the food makes the wine better and all of that makes the conversation better. It's, um, it's just a part of a good life. Here at Bravante Vineyards, uh, what we try to produce is really intense and complex uh, Bordeaux varietals from our vineyards here on Howe Mountain. And uh, Cabernets, Merlots, Bordeaux blends, and just try to get um, varietal character and intensity into them. Howe Mountain is a very unique appellation. Um, it doesn't start till 1,400 feet, and it's all volcanic soils. Um, Howe Mountain wasn't a volcano, but it was all upthrust from the uh, interior of uh, the earth. And um, what makes it unique is the soils, plus we are, as the Howe Mountain vintners and growers say, above the fog. So what that gives us is, even though we start later in the spring with bud break, gives us hours of sunshine and photosynthesis, but it also keeps it cool because the fog in the valley works as a heat sink. What we get is, with these long days of cool sunshine, we get a lot of ripening, but not intense and not raisiny flavors at all. We get just fresh fruit flavors. Well, what I think is really exciting is working with Howe Mountain grapes. We get this intensity, we get the structure, and we make big wines, but they're not overwhelming and they're not so tannic that you can't drink them and you have to age them forever. They will age for a long time and really get some benefit of that but you, what you get is a lot of complexity to them and there's just depths of flavors with them and that's just really exciting. And it's great to work with a true estate where we're growing all of this fruit. On, we have two pieces of property up here on Howe Mountain, Cabernet on both, Cabernet Franc on both. I get pick it when I want into the tank I want it to go into and produce it the way I want. And um, they get picked in the morning. They're picked by about 11 and they're crushed by three. We've dug caves in our hill underneath our vineyards here. They're a great environment for aging wine. What it gives us is a very constant temperature. What we're featuring here at Bravante Vineyards for Cellar Angels is our 2006 Howe Mountain Cabernet. It's an intense wine with nice structure, good complexity. Um, the 2006 vintage is not super fruit forward, but it's also not just totally structured. There's some great raspberry flavors and some sage and some other flavors that are all really um, make it uh, just lovely to drink. The nicest thing about visiting up here is that we're really small. It's a family owned winery. George and Nancy Bravante own the property. They're here a lot. They, they make us feel their passion. Um, being as small as we are, it, it, puts, it, it puts the hand back in handcrafted. Um, to see the grapes come in, to see them go into the fermenting tanks, to see them go into the bottle, to see George and Nancy here working the tanks and the barrels, to see Dwayne working it. It's real small, it's real honest, it's great wine. It's good people making a good product. It's been great getting people coming up here tasting. They're, they really enjoy it when they come and um, Dave in our tasting room does a great job of te teaching them about wine. He could teach somebody who knows nothing, somebody who knows a lot. He can help them learn more. Well, the Cellar Angels to get exposure to some new customers. Um, hopefully some of you will come and enjoy our beautiful hospitality here and um, giving the people who buy our wine a, ch a chance to give back I think is very important for myself as the winemaker and George and Nancy they, they really believe in giving back when they can to whatever they can.